This is BTV. In the deserts of northern Nevada sits land that is scorching hot. Hot enough for Canadian company Nevada Geothermal Power, or NGP for short, to produce green energy from Mother Nature herself. NGP is a renewable energy company developing geothermal projects in the U.S. to provide electrical energy that is clean, renewable and profitable. Combining years of experience, a lot of hard work and an industry on the cusp of an explosion, NGP is ready to make an impression. Well, Nevada Geothermal Power was formed several years ago, but uh, we're developers of uh, geothermal resources, which is clean energy technology. We selected Nevada as the place that we wanted to start because there's an existing uh, geothermal industry there and, and uh, an abundance of geothermal resources. So we'll start there. Uh, we've got a flagship property at Blue Mountain where we're just starting construction of a 50 megawatt plant. This flagship property was originally being explored for gold, which turned into a substantial revenue benefit for NGP. There is already $5 million worth of field data that was acquired with the purchase of the property. However, it took a keen eye from a geothermal veteran to see the real potential. I did uh, uh, recognize in the geology some very uh, good structural environment and some very high grade uh, silica alteration there that was uh, indirectly uh, pointing uh, to an underlying geothermal system, but it was unusual in that there was no surface manifestation. We were going on a, a lot of geological faith in the early in the early days. Faith that looks to pay off, geothermal power is a natural source of power. It's the mining of Mother Nature's heat. Plants use the heat from the earth to power turbines, producing clean, renewable energy. Energy that is in high demand. And so there's a lot of focus on uh, not only new energy but new clean energy. And geothermal uh, power is basically pollution free, uh, particularly the binary power plants, there's no air emissions uh, whatsoever. And so that we are competitive with conventional forms of power. In the 90s there was a lot of new gas turbine power built and geothermal can provide the same power for less cost. NGP has assembled a team loaded with experience, led by CEO Brian Fairbank, who is Canada's foremost geothermal expert, with over 30 years in geothermal engineering, drilling and field projects. Between management and the board of directors, they have over 150 years of hands-on geothermal experience. NGP currently has four geothermal projects in the pipeline, which they oversee from offices in Vancouver, Reno, and in the northern Nevada town of Winnemucca. First on the docket is phase one of the Blue Mountain Project, which has proved unbelievable results in testing. And we've had phenomenal success out here. Uh, our very first production well, 26A, which we drilled in 2006, we had, uh, it's a 10 megawatt well, so we ended up with uh, 7.2 megawatts net, which is pretty amazing. And then we drilled uh, 2314 and 2514 also big producers, they're over 10 megawatts, 7.5 megawatts net. And then um, this spring, uh, 5815, which was even more amazing, we were looking for a shallow injection, which we found, and we were looking for deeper injection when we hit the largest production well we've seen. Uh, when it started to flow, it's amazing. With all this potential power, choosing the ideal spot for the plant would be crucial. That was strategically decided by 30-year power plant veteran, Max Wellenchuk. We moved it to a site which is fairly flat, uh, easy to access because there's an existing road and, and it, uh, it's near all the production wells and, and it won't be that far from the injection well. So it was, it was selected to sort of minimize capital costs. So on the flanks of a mountain so we're not, uh, we're not having to deal with you know, steep grades or anything like that. Now that they're tapping into the heat source and locked down the location, the project is really picking up steam. And it doesn't hurt when you partnered with a geothermal industry leader. Uh, the plant, uh, the, we've selected ORMAT to, to build the plant and they're doing what we call an EPC contract, an engineering procurement and construction contract. Uh, the engineering is very far along, almost I would say probably in the order of 90% complete. Uh, the procurement is very, also very far along. The major equipment has been procured. 
and it's being manufactured as we speak. NGP plan on having all the foundations finished this year, and in the early spring, the plant parts will start arriving to the site. The whole thing will be finished and up and running by the end of 2009, producing green energy and revenue. We have completed our construction financing, which is just amazing in this, in this economic market, so our future is secure. And I just think of this as like the little engine that could. We just keep plugging away, plugging away, and we've made it. This is it. We've hit the big time. We'll be producing, and there's no end in sight. No end indeed, especially with the signed power purchase agreement with Nevada Power Company for up to 50 megawatts of geothermal power once it comes online. With all the pieces to the puzzle complete, NGP looks to start producing. I'd say the goal is, is to bring power. The geothermal resources here, we're in the process of developing it. We feel there's at least 50 megawatts here in the ground, and that's what we're going to bring online December 2009. That's just what the industry needs, as reliable power is needed to maintain a successful economy. Therefore, the emphasis will clearly be on clean power, and the U.S. is a huge supporter of such projects. About 50 percent of the states in the United States uh, have what they call renewable energy programs. And the renewable energy programs require the utilities, the electricity producers, to produce and sell a percentage of their output from renewable resources by specific dates. So in Nevada, for example, the utility must sell 20% of its electricity from renewable resources by 2015. With the plan in place, the team committed, and the demand so high, what's next for NGP? We would still like to uh, advance our other projects uh, fairly aggressively. So that means we'll want to uh, partner up with funding companies and, and potentially raise a significant amount of more money in a diff difficult market. So we're, we'll work on structuring something that, that fits that challenge. It might not be such a challenge. Both the geothermal and financial industry are keeping an eye on this young up-and-comer. NGP has three other development properties outside of Blue Mountain that look to be just as hot. We also are building uh, a project in a, a place called Pumpernickel Valley. Um, we'll, we should be drilling a well there very shortly. Uh, and then at, in addition we have Crump Geyser which is also, we're drilling, going to be drilling some thermal gradient wells. All three of those projects, uh, or future projects, we, we fully expect to be able to um, build power plants and, and, uh, and sell additional megawatts. Combined, those three projects have an estimated gross production of 200 megawatts, or enough energy to power 200,000 homes. Nowadays, with such a huge focus on green energy, the future does look bright in the desert for this Canadian company. I think aside from the economy that uh, developing new power in such a way that they, we don't destroy the planet is going to be one of the biggest challenges for mankind in the next, over the next 20 years. And uh, there's a strong emphasis on, uh, on building up clean power technology. Uh, we have uh, very much a head start, Nevada Geothermal does, amongst our peers because we got back into the geothermal business in the 90s and uh, we've established a very credible team. Uh, we've got a good track record through the last uh, two years at Blue Mountain. We've shown what we can do, and the future is very bright for Nevada Geothermal Power. And what they've shown is that they will soon be on the road to revenue through the geothermal landscape. You can research NGP more at their website. They're at www.nevadageothermal.com.